Hello, my Libras. How are you guys doing? Thank you for your patience. And I'm going to go ahead and get started on a Libra reading. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Let's see what's going on with my Libras, okay? This is also for cross watchers. So if you're not a Libra, but you're watching for a Libra, or however it resonates, take this as it resonates. Okay, so what's going on with my Libras? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter. Okay, I'm gonna get one card for the overall energy here. The overall energy for Libras that you guys need to know. Strength reverse. Now, if I get too many reversals, guys, I'm just gonna do them upright. But some of you guys might not be feeling your strongest right now. You also might, I'm hearing, not be able to hold back when it comes to like some sort of communication that you feel like you shouldn't engage in. Okay. I feel like you guys want to confront someone on their lies. Okay, so this is, the left side is going to be you. The left side is going to be you. I'm going to pull like three cards. The moon. There's definitely some secrets. I feel, okay, the other thing I'm feeling is like you don't trust someone to tell them the truth. You're hiding, you're actually hiding the truth from someone. What is this about? Why are you hiding the truth? Now, if you're watching for a Libra, that could resonate with you. You're caught up in your head about it, though. Two sevens. Knight of Pentacles, Virgos. It's something that I feel like you're working on. Um, I feel like you're working on telling them the truth. But it's, I almost feel like you guys feel, not in like a totally negative way, but in a weird way you feel like empowered by not revealing it all. Like by keeping this person guessing, you could be dealing with a Virgo, um, you feel empowered. All right, let's see your person's energy. Capricorn. So I feel like this person's kind of F with you before and now maybe you have the upper hand and you're effing with them. Six of Swords reverse. You feel like this person never moves forward in the way you want them to. So you're like, well, I'm going to play their game back. Okay, you could be dealing with a Capricorn here. A Leo. Six of Cups reversed. Mm. This could be someone from your past. This is interesting because we have Eight of Pentacles, Eight of Swords on this side. I feel like um, this person, you guys are kind of mirroring each other because I feel like they are caught up in bullshit that's happened with you in the past and so are you. Neither of you guys can let go of the past. So like what's their overall thoughts about the past? They do want to work things out, but they wonder if it's worth the effort. Okay, their overall energy about the past. Hey, so they want they want a new beginning, but I also feel like maybe they did a lot of work in the past. And but you feel like they lied a lot in the past, like they were dishonest. You see, this is yours. Ace of Swords. Okay, so there's this Ace of Pentacles. I oh uh, uh yeah, you guys, this is so clear. So they feel like they put a lot more energy, but you feel like you were a lot more honest. You feel like you were a lot more direct. You didn't hold things back, and now you're holding back. They feel like they did all the effort, and now they're holding the energy and effort back. <laughs> wow, you guys, this is like so clear to me. Okay, so um, what do they want to communicate to you, Libras? I mean, it's kind of clear. Just drop my box here. What do they want to say to you, Libras? There's a lot of blame game going on here, but two very stubborn people, I feel. Now, if this is someone that you don't even have a relationship with, then I feel like this could be future energies. But now you're like, since they're not making the effort, you're feeling like you need to make the effort. I bury myself and work to forget you. It was my fault, but I blamed you. You see? You feel like even though they put effort in the past, they were never really honest. So you couldn't ever really allow them in. And so it looked like you weren't giving effort, but it's really because you didn't trust them. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. 
I mean, they're very caught up in their head with this Libra. I'm waiting for an apology. Okay, so when I first opened this box, guys, there was an I'm sorry card, but I didn't want to mention it because I didn't know if it, you see, it was still in there from a prior reading. <laughs> this person is like keeping this up, apology from you, I feel. <sighs> this is so messed up, Libras. What have you guys gotten yourself into? Leaving you hurt me too. All right, so what else can we find out here, Libras? I'm gonna use the answer deck. So let's see if there's a future with you and this person. What's the future looking like, Libras, for you guys? I mean, both of you are stubborn as hell. That's part of the problem. Is there a future? Take action and yes. Okay. Now, I don't know if this is saying... Do Libras have to take action or will the other person take action? Do Libras take action or does the other person take action? Be assertive. Okay. Message for the for Libras. What do Libras do? Too many cards here. What do Libras do? Improving health within the next few weeks. You guys just need to work on yourself, okay? Because you're giving this situation way too much energy. And it's making you kind of sick. I don't think this, that's the thing, the difference is, I don't think this person is sick over you. Not that they don't care, but I think this has impacted you more than it's impacted them. Like, okay? So I'm going to get more future energies. Future energy for you and future energy for the other person you're dealing with. Future energy for you, Libra. Outcome energy. This is an I'm sorry, but this could also be them apologizing. This is, I feel like you guys are going to end up messaging them. Whoever's watching this. It's Pisces energy. What's their future energy? Page of Swords. We got Page of Cups, Page of Swords. Huh. Eight of Cups reversed. They're coming back. Um, this to me is actually like they could end up being honest with you. See, that's what they lacked is honesty. And you lacked being open. You're not going to have to wait too much longer, Libras. Everything is fine with this Ten of Swords. Okay, I'm going to try to use this deck, but it's like hidden under, not hidden. I just said that, that was channeled. You see, there's a lot of hidden stuff. And I think that's what bothers you guys the most is that you don't just want like to talk to them. You want answers. You feel like they hid things from you. And I'm dropping everything here. Sorry, guys. Central oil. Okay. Okay. You also don't want this, like, them pretending like, oh, we're just going to pick up where we left off. Like, I feel like you may have tried to talk to them and they were just, like, blowing off, like, having a serious, honest conversation. All right, so let's get some more answers here, Libras. Libras, what else do we need to know? You should have, you shouldn't have to try so hard. The time has passed. There is a lot about the past here, guys. I think you guys wonder, like, is it over? Like, so good, so true. Wow. I feel like the one. Okay, this is someone extremely important to you guys. Mm, all is well everything is fine all is well I get this very avoidant energy and I think that annoys you I don't think that that's like you don't feel like all is well and everything is fine let's get one more card you want to address things that's the feeling I get Libra 
small gestures. And that's what that page of cups is about. They may end up giving you a small gesture. It may end up being up to you where you want to go with it. Okay? That's the feeling I'm getting. So I hope this reading resonated for you, Libra. Thanks for being here on my channel. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.